Okay, now we're doing our next version of Sensei's Life Lessons. Today I'm going to show you how to make limeade. Okay, so here we are. We're here back in the kitchen again. Um, I have other life lessons besides learning how to cook stuff and everything like that, but today um, I was going to make my kids some limeade, and I know what you're asking yourselves. You're saying to yourselves, why are you making limeade, Sensei? Why wouldn't you make lemonade? Well, here's the, here's the thing. First of all, I had no available lemons, so the only thing I had was limes, and if you look here, let me show you all the ingredients here, but look here. Look at these beautiful limes. Now, you know, on TV, we usually have limes that look very, very green, but you want almost that like yellowish tinge to have the lime actually ripen. Now, I don't know if you're able to make this special drink that I'm about to make because these limes come from Inoue Farms. Now, Inoue Farms is a very distinct farming technique where they make all sorts of produce all over that you cannot find except for at Inoue Farms. Now I'll tell you a little bit about the technique, how special this is. Um, on Inoue Farms they actually use a Japanese slash Okinawan farming technique to actually cultivate these limes so that they have a very distinct not only like, you know our limes are sour, but a sweet sour taste that you can only get from an Inoue farm lime. Okay, here's the other ingredients you need. Inoue, now if you just have regular limes, it's fine. It'll work, might not be as delicious, but use them. But this is Inoue farm limes. Okay, next ingredient, all you need is natural, this is all natural, limes and sugar and of course water. Um, here are the tools you're gonna need. You're gonna need a cutting board and a knife, saucepan to make a simple sugar, a pitcher to store the limeade in, and of course you will need a juicer. First step is we're gonna make the lime juice. Now, first thing you need to do is, all you have to do is just cut the lime in half like so. Okay, I'm probably gonna use about, you basically need about one cup one cup of lime juice. So I'm, look, oh my gosh. Look at that. That is a lime. Look at that. Oh, you can also use this for cleaning, by the way. Kills germs. Now, also another thing that you know, since right now we're having a, a pandemic going on right here, and you know, I am also, I'm not a doctor, but I tell my students that I know everything, even though I don't. And what I like to say is that even though this will not defeat, this will not prevent the coronavirus, this will build your immunity system. Okay, so you're gonna get those nice little immunities things inside. Oh yeah, that's what this is gonna do. So once we cut these things, you're just gonna go ahead and for each line, you're gonna, you're gonna go on the juicer and you're gonna push firm and get that juice out of, look at that. See all that out? And then you just keep going. You keep going until you have one cup of lime juice. One cup, keep squeezing it out, okay? And we're just gonna go ahead and, I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna keep going these out until I get one cup, okay? So, we'll be back. 
And then you can see when we, after we have one cup of lime juice. So here. far, look what we've done so far. If you look, look at all these beautiful, look at, look at all this immunization booster just right in there, right there from Inoue Farms. Now, so we got about a cup of lime juice right there. Now, if you drink that, that'll be very tart but sweet because, again, it's Noe Farms uh, lime. Um, it's the, the ripened kind. And then, remember, the Okinawan, Okinawan Japanese technique. That's where this richness comes from here. Um, you know, before I, I, as ignorant as it was, before I knew anything about the Okinawan culture, the only thing I knew was from the Karate Kid Part 2, which isn't very, um, I don't know. Now I'm just, it's, it just isn't enough. So, okay. Now, look here. We have one cup of boiling water. So what you need, everything's a cup. Cup of lime juice, cup of boiling water, one cup of sugar. Take the sugar. What we're going to make is called a simple syrup. You're going to take the sugar, the one cup of sugar, and you're going to mix it in the boiling water. Look at that. Now, this helps those of you that are in chemistry, you know, you're taking chemistry right now, and you're, you're, you, you understand that in, in order to blend these, these chemicals together, the H2O and the, R, the um, CH, um, CHOH, which is sugar, those are the, that's the chemistry compound for sugar. Actually, honestly, I don't know what the chemistry compound for sugar is, but I know it's something. But you need the heat to blend it, right? So now look at this. As you're, as as you bring this, I'm gonna turn the heat up, so it comes to a boil, and you can see, see the little granules of sugar. You want it to become a syrup. Once it heats up, that will become, uh, the granules will be gone. So you want to keep getting that till all those granules are gone almost to like a light boil, but you don't want to boil it too much. You just want it combined, that's it. Okay, so here we go, it's just going. And we'll come back and we'll show you where, when it's at a light boil. Okay, there you go, see that's, there you go, that's two cups, that's one cup of sugar, one cup of water right there. Okay, now, here comes the easy part. All you need to do is once that's blended, let's turn that heat off. Okay, you're gonna take this, and you're gonna go ahead and put it into our pitcher. Simple syrup is complete. All we're gonna do is we're gonna take the simple syrup and we're gonna pour the simple syrup here in the pitcher. Careful not to spill, it's hot. This is hot stuff right here. Pour it in the pitcher. There you go. Perfectly blended, sugar and water right there. Next, all we have to do is take the Lime juice, you pour it in, see how it's steamy, but watch, we're going to get it nice and cool there. Oh yeah, look at that, you got the pulp, you got the aroma, mmm, oh my gosh. Okay, next, all you have to do is just add water to taste. So we're going to go over here to our little water faucet here, pour it in. This will give. This will cool it down as the ingredients are now blended together. We'll mix it all up. The sugar's already in. The lime's already in. The vitamin C is already in. Right. This will just. This will just. Again. This is. This is. Uh, uh, for build your immune system. This is a building your immune system recipe. Okay. Next, we'll probably add a little bit of ice. Got a nice little ice machine here. Oh, it's spilling all over the place. Okay. There we go. And then, now to finish it all off, what you want to do is, like if you're having, if you want to make a good presentation, you have, you're having your guests over, um, you want to make it look good, look clean, look professional. This is about having professional, professional you want to just get those little orange, those little lime slices like that, maybe three or four.
Ooh, I got a little half one that makes it look very, very country stylish. Put it in there like that. Look at that. And then you must go ahead and you want to take a little old fashioned lime juice here. Make sure it probably needs a little bit more water. Just want to get it to taste. I want to see how this tastes. Okay, here we go. Sweetie. Oh, refreshing. This is Sensei. Life lessons showing you how to make that limeade. Bye-bye.